Well, back to school coverage you can count on on this Monday morning. You can bet there are some groggy kids about to be struggling to wake up this week as their parents try to get them back into their back-to-school routines for that first day of class. Pediatricians agree helping kids get back into that back-to-school mode has its challenges. That you finish how you start. Pediatrician Dr. Daniel McNeil makes no bones about it. How you get your kids up and going. A really good hearty breakfast. So something that has whole grains, something that has good protein. Plays a big part in how you wind them down at night. So, he says, does how you structure their day. A semi-scheduled day where we're active, where we got out in the sun, we played hard for an hour, we had a nap time if it's age appropriate for us, and we had regularly scheduled meal times. Simply put, he says, active kids sleep better, but still may need some winding down before bed, starting, he says, by putting down devices an hour before bedtime. Having that natural light as opposed to the blue light of our screen on in front of our face really helps your brain to calm down and really helps you to sleep. After that, McNeil says it all comes down to what he calls the four B's. You want to do bath, you want to do brush, you want to do book in bed. Bath, brush, book, and bed. Sounds pretty easy, but he admits that is a challenge sometimes. So McNeil recommends parents also avoid letting their kids have any kind of coffee or energy drinks in the morning. And by the way, be sure to check back in a few days because I will check back with Dr. McNeil to find out what do you do if these tips he just gave haven't worked.